I first saw ballet when I was six years old. The ballet company came and performed at my family's church in my hometown of Charlotte, North Carolina. And I remember being mesmerized. I was really struck by the male dancers. I've always thought that the male ballet dancer is kind of like a warrior poet. And that planted in me this dream of coming to New York to dance with New York City Ballet. I arrived here when I was 14 to begin this very rigorous ballet training. There was a supporter of the ballet who gave me a membership to the Met Museum. I was always very curious about how ballet was connected to the other art forms. And in the Met, I found a place that was designed for a person like me. I saw the rhythm in repetition of a pattern, the movement in a brush stroke in a painting, the clean lines and the precision of shapes and the grace, this mix of strength and sensitivity that I'm trying to cultivate as a ballet dancer. The idea of épaulement is very important in classical ballet. You're adding contour to the use of your upper body and you see that in Rodin. The Burgers of Calais is like a tableau for a corps de ballet. I come here to be inspired, to find a clue, to find the next step. There are these long scroll pieces in the Chinese wing with written commentary from later generations in the same way that classical ballet is taught person to person. It creates this deep embodied dialogue across the ages.